Well, I've just got back from Greenhouse Meadow um, for today's pre Oldham press conference. We spoke with assistant uh, manager Chris Doig and town midfielder Abu Agogo. Uh, you can catch all the fallout from, from Agogo in tomorrow's Shropshire Star, but, but for now, uh, some immediate team news ahead of the, the crucial crunch sort of League One tie with um, Oldham the weekend. It's almost a six pointer, isn't it? Both clubs in, in the drop zone. And not the best news in terms of Shrewsbury Town uh, inj on the injury front. Uh, Louis Dodds. Uh, will miss the game. Uh, he hasn't missed many this season. He's one of the club's highest appearance makers. It's been that, that sort of glue that's gelled everything together on his day. You know, scoring goals as the joint top scorer creates. Um, he's out. He went off injured last weekend against Bradford, of course, in the win. It was only the only real sour note, and, and he hasn't recovered, so he misses the game alongside skipper Adam Elabd who also uh, went off in that game. He hasn't recovered either. So those two are fresh faces on the sidelines. Um, they join McGiven, Ryan McGiven, another defender who hasn't quite recovered yet. He's not up to, to, to playing competitively after his shoulder injury. And also AJ Leach-Smith, who is, who is still ongoing with his troublesome knee. Uh, Jack Grimmer and Ollie Lancashire on the plus side, two defenders returning to the team. So at least there's a bit of a balance in terms of players coming back in. But not great news to, to be missing Dodds. Perhaps uh, a chance for, for newcomer Tyler Roberts, the young loanee from West Bromwich Albion, to go straight into the team and, and have an impact in place of Dodds. We'll see on that. Other bit of news to, to, to tell you um, from the press conference is, is that it's really unchanged in terms of Ian Black, uh, the Scottish midfielder, who is away due to personal circumstances. Um, he's still not involved, not, not at the club, not been training and he won't be involved in the match. Uh, so, so there's more of that to, to catch up on, on shropshire.com and make sure you check out in the, uh, in the newspaper.